Greetings, friends. So I was playing the Kevin bot, rated 2300 at chess.com, and I made a queen sacrifice and uh, won this after 22 moves. And um, I normally don't play this well, so I wanted to make a video of it just for my own documentation and to share with the public. So I'm going to try to make this a quick one. Um, I wanted to try, when I was coming into this, I was wanting to try something aggressive. Uh, and to my surprise, it worked. Um, so here, in the beginning, uh, in the opening, uh, what I try to tell myself is it's a battle royale for the opening. Um, sometimes I don't necessarily care about what Bebop and Bizbam did in 1705. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Um, I do study openings in other Grandmaster games, but um, I mostly keep in my mind uh, to control the center. Um, so here I'm eyeing this queen, and I'll show you my aggressive tactic that's coming up here pretty quick. So I'm trying to um, set something up because I do see, you know, look, if this happens and this happens, it's over, I win. Um, at 2300, um, I don't think the Kevin bot's going to make it that easy on me. Um, so here, I ignore this. And um, because, uh, I mean, if it takes, it, it it's over. That's mate. So um, it pushes the pawn down. And uh, I decide just to keep going. I'm going to try something. I'm going to keep the hammer down. That's part of the fun of these bots. Um, so now I'm getting some pieces lined up and um, I'm just going to try to keep that hammer down on the king side. And so now I'm back to my um, original plan of getting this uh, uh, queen uh, here. Because I have this rook, the H file is open and I own it. I have a major piece on it. And so, um, so there it is. Now, I can't just go here. I, I have to come here first to kick that king. Okay, so there the king is kicked. And there's the queen sacrifice. And there's mate on move 22. So... Um, I just thought I'd share that. I need to get back to playing live people again, and I will. In 2024, you're going to see me doing a lot more live games uh, against people. Uh, like I said, in 2023, I've mostly been doing puzzles. I didn't realize that uh, I I've been doing just mostly puzzles. I I've got my puzzle ELO rating over 2,700. But um, I need to get back to playing live people. So that's what 2024 is going to be all about. But anyway, I just thought I'd share this. And hopefully it helps the audience. And it's good for me to review. So thank you for watching.